Hello, I'm Dr Ferguson, Dermatology Consultant at St George's Hospital. In this video, I'm going to talk about factors that can trigger an eczema flare in your child, followed by practical advice about living with eczema. Even though your child has a long-term tendency to dry skin and eczema, external factors may make their skin worse, and this will vary from child to child. Food allergy is more common in children who have severe eczema. Eating certain foods can result in an immediate reaction with a rash called urticaria or hives, and also a tummy upset. Or the allergy can be delayed so that eating certain food flares up your child's eczema a day or two later. A food diary can help you to identify triggers. Most children's eczema isn't driven by food allergies, and even if your child is known to have a food allergy, it's worth sticking with the emollients and topical steroids to ensure that you address the skin inflammation. Some children react to wool clothing. Cotton is usually better. Eczema is often worse in winter. Overheating can make the itch worse, and eczema sometimes flares more when the central heating is on. Children with eczema are prone to skin infections, which may in turn aggravate their eczema. In general, it's fine to take your child to a swimming pool, but the chlorine can make some children's eczema worse. So it's helpful to rinse off in a shower after swimming and reapply emollients before getting dressed. Parents often find it challenging to fit in all the emollient applications for their children throughout the day especially if they're in school or nursery. It may help to show your children's key worker or teacher their treatment plan. If house dust mite is a trigger, making adjustments to your children's bedrooms by avoiding carpets, rugs and soft toys can help. Keeping the bedroom cool at night may help, as well as keeping children's nails short to reduce cuts due to scratching. Special garments may be helpful at night when itching is often at its worst. Antihistamines may help with sleep disturbance during flares, but they're not recommended as a long-term treatment. Understanding eczema well will help you manage it more effectively and hopefully reduce the impact that it has on your child.